good afternoon guys today is my biggest grocery haul that i have ever done i've never done a grocery haul this large before but last night i ordered my click and collect and it was about 300 dollars worth of groceries because we needed some staples that we don't usually need to buy and also i bought some more cereal containers so we, we're going to stock the cupboard with some different kinds of cereal for the kids because they always have the same chocolate milo cereal anyway this is for our family of six this is a week's worth of groceries it's 300 dollars it's school at time at the moment so the kids are going to school so it includes school lunches and breakfast lunches and dinner for all of the family members so without further ado let's get into my giant $300 Coles grocery haul. Okay, so I didn't really categorize. I apologize about that, but let's just start from this side and move across. I got three loaves of bread. This will last us three days. These three loaves of bread will last us three days. I will have to go back and get some more, but this is for school lunches and breakfast and just lunches for Talia and things like that. I got some hot dog buns because as you can guess, I'm going to make some hot dogs. I've got a uh, three liter bottle of milk here. This will probably last us the week, maybe. And then I have just a little um, one liter Coke, no sugar for myself. These are Evie's favorite yogurt. So I got her three of the vanilla ones. The variety pack for the kids' school lunches. I got some light sour cream for tacos that I'm making and feta cheese for the TikTok viral pasta dish that I'm just like obsessed with now. Please keep in mind that I have very picky eaters as kids, so try not to judge as I move on. Um, hummus, I have hummus. This is for me to snack on and also chilea with some carrots and cucumber throughout the week. I got some shredded ham for pizzas and two packets of the poppers for the kids' school lunches. I got two boxes of tissues some hot dog frankfurts and some ham for the kids school lunches. I've got some strawberries because Talia and Evie love strawberries. Two punnets of cherry tomatoes for the TikTok um, pasta hack that everyone loves. I got some basil for that as well. Some blueberries and two zucchinis down here for my veggie packed pizza sauce that I'm going to be making for the kids to hide <laughs> veggies in their pizza. Um, I got two cucumbers because Talia is obsessed with snacking on these throughout the day. And I got some lettuce for tacos as well. A big packet of baby spinach back here for the TikTok pasta thing and also for breakfast to put with eggs and things like that. I got some corn for a silver side roast that I'm making. Two packets of carrots because Talia are obs is obsessed with snacking on these. A frozen bag of corn cobs. This is what I put um, as Evie's, one of Evie's veggies with her dinners. And then I got two bags of broccoli, frozen broccoli florets. I go through these like crazy. This will last me like a week. Evie loves broccoli. And then I got some baby peas for some cottage pie that I'm making and some french fries with some, um, to put as a side for one of the dishes this week. I got some tiny teddies because the kids love these for school and Talia likes to snack on them throughout the day as well. These are all for me. <laughs> these look delicious. I saw these and they're on special and I was like, why not? They're snacks for me. I got some quick oats for Evie's breakfast because I make oatmeal fingers that she loves and we're running low on oats. This is also for me, <laughs> just a um, mint choc chip Kit Kat like bar to snack on at nighttime. Three, <laughs> I'm not the healthiest as you can probably tell. Um, I got three of these fragrance-free um, Cub brand baby wipes. I got two tomatoes for tacos, some pasta passata, is that how you say that? Um, sauce for the um, pizza sauce that I'm making that has veggies in it. I also have a video on that, I'll link that in the iCards if I can remember to do so. Um, some white potatoes, a big bag of white potatoes to use for the cottage pie and also as a side for the roast that I'm making. Some seedless white grapes because the kids love snacking on these at school and also in the afternoon after dinner or after school. I got five red apples because both Lily and Talia love red apples. These look amazing and I've never tried them and I'm pretty sure they were on special so I bought these for myself as well. And the pizza bases obviously for pizzas for the week. These are also for me because I'm a big snacker, if you, if you can't tell. I got um, cheese and bacon shapes as well as barbecue flavored shapes. 
Comment down below what your favorite flavor of shapes is because this is my favorite. Everyone loves the pizza one and I'm just not a big fan. Like I don't hate it, but it's not my favorite. Also, as I said, these like this brand was on special. So I, I wanted to try the balsamic and vinegar and sea salt ones as well. The different cereals that we're buying instead of just the Milo chocolate cereal for the kids is Nutrigrain, Fruit Loops and Cocoa Pops. I know they're not the healthiest, but it's better than nothing. The kids generally skip breakfast. I'm not sure why this is open. I'll make sure that the bag inside is sealed shut, but the kids generally skip breakfast if they're like, they're getting bored of the chocolate cereal. So I wanted to give them a bit of variety just to encourage them to eat at least something for the morning, especially the bigger kids. They get up before we do and they get up really early and make themselves breakfast. So if they have them available, they're more likely gonna do that. I got some baked twist K-time bars for their school lunches and a taco kit, obviously the tacos. I got some penne pasta for the pasta TikTok thing that I was talking about. I got a big pack of chicken schnitzels. The kids love these. This is Evie's favorite meal, is chicken schnitzels with like chips and vegetables as a side. I got some garlic bread as a side for the pizza. These are for dessert for the kids. It encourages, especially Jet, who's our picky eater, to eat his vegetables, eat his dinner, and then he gets a treat at the end of it. Yeah, that's just how we do it. Um, I also sneak one of these into their lunches for school. And then we have a bunch of like baby pouch food things. This is just for when, like the days that I don't have time to cook lunch or breakfast or whatever. Evie's not huge on breakfast or lunch. She kind of doesn't eat a whole lot for breakfast or lunch. Even if I make her like an extravagant breakfast or lunch, she basically throws it all on the floor. So she's more likely to eat something if I give her one of these. I also got her just these little, um, muesli bars for on the go to keep her entertained in the pram if we're going somewhere. I also got, oh, I also got a big pack of Nutri-Grain bars. I think Lily will really like these. I don't think Jet eats Nutri-Grain, but I think she'll really like them. Maybe he'll eat it because it's got chocolate on it. I don't know. I also bought some strawberry jam for the kids' lunches for school. One of these, I can't even remember what recipe this is for. Oh, this is for the um, cottage pie. I also got a tin of pineapple pieces for the pizza that went that I'm making. This these little um, fiddle sticks. Evie loves these snacks. They're like a dollar seventy each though, so I just buy them as like a treat every now and then. A roll of large kitchen tidy bags, so just like garbage bags. And then I've also got two things of mints down here, two containers. So this one's a kilo. That is for the cottage pie, and then this one here is five hundred grams for the uh, tacos. I've got a bunch of bananas here. Jet likes bananas, which is a miracle. And then I've got two um, turkey rissoles down here. I did not know that the kids liked rissoles. I, I assumed when I served them that I was going to really struggle to get Jet to eat them, but he liked them last week. So I bought them again and they're turkey. So they're a little bit healthier because we do have a little bit of red meat throughout here. So it's good to get some white meat in there. I also got a big um, can of dry shampoo because mum life. A Messy Monkeys like snack pack. I had I bought the tomato tomato sauce flavored ones last week and Evie loved them. Talia wasn't a big fan but Evie loved them so I thought I'd try my luck with the burger flavor. Hopefully she likes them just as much. They're on special for like $5.70 or something like that or $5.40. So I got another packet of those. It's got eight pack like eight little tiny packets in there. And I got some corned silver side for obviously silver side that I'll be making throughout the week. A resealable bag. I've tried so many different ones of these, like the reusable ones. I've tried so many of them and none of them work right. I bought them from Kmart, like reusable ones that you don't just um, like chuck out after each use. And after like two or three uses, it wouldn't snap shut anymore, which is super annoying because I really, really liked them. I also had the it was like bumblebee honey wraps. I really, really liked those as well, but Lily left them in her lunch box over the school holidays and they went moldy. So I'm back to using these, which is extremely frustrating. Um, I bought a big pack of Robert Tim's coffee bags. I really, really, really like these ones. My favorite flavor is actually the Mocha Kenya, but they didn't have any um, in stock because they're on special this week. So I, this is probably my second favorite, the Italian espresso. And then I got Tim Tams. I know a lot of you guys don't have Tim Tams where you are in the world because I think it's an Australian thing. You are missing out guys. These are the best biscuits in the world and they're on special this week for $3. So I bought a pack of those for myself. 
And I mean, if the kids want some, they can have some too. And then I got some um, eggs here for breakfasts and I like to make pan like banana pancakes with them for Evie as well. I got two tins of tuna to put on crackers for myself as a snack and then this giant bag of chips for the kids' school lunches as well. Anyway guys, that is my giant like $300 Coles grocery haul. Let me know what you think down below. Also, don't forget to let me know what your favorite flavor of shapes are. I'm very interested to hear what you have to say about that. I feel like I'm the only one whose favorite flavor is not pizza. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you want to see more content like this and subscribe down below if you want to follow our journey and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.